You want to hyperlink an image in Gmail, and I'm going to teach you two methods to do it. There's the easy way that you can do right inside Gmail's Compose window, and then there's the programmer's way, which lets you manipulate the HTML inside the Gmail Compose window. So let's bring up my screen, and first, here's the easy way. I've just added the image, and the first thing we're going to do is to drag the mouse over it to highlight it and select it. It should have this blue overlay on top of the image. Next, we're going to click the hyperlink icon. Now at first, it looks like it didn't do anything, but it actually did, because if I single click the image now, you can see that it's actually hyperlinked to itself, which is fine because now it's given us a link to work with. And now what we do is we click change, and now we set this to the link we want. And we're done. Now to test it, just single click it again and make sure that the link appears. And that is how you link an image the easy way. Pretty easy, huh? But now let me show you the programmer's way. If you're a fast typer and you know HTML, this method will shave a few seconds off the process, which is especially helpful if you're linking a lot of images. In fact, you can use this technique to manipulate any aspect of your message's HTML. Let's go to my screen. I'm going to show you how to use Chrome's developer tools to manipulate the HTML to add a link to this image right here. So to start, we're going to right click on the image and go to, actually it's very important that the image is not selected when you right click on it. Inspect. And now you can see the image tag right here for that image. And what we're going to do is we're going to edit this HTML and we're going to add an href tag. Don't forget the closing tag and we're done. Now we're just going to exit out of here. I'm going to close Chrome's DevTools, and now if I single click on it, you'll see that the link has been added, and we're done. And that's it. If you like this video, please hit that subscribe button.